So what are we doing tonight? Going to Eva's orchestra concert. Down at the school. Yeah. Two and a half hours that we will not get back. No, I'm kidding. We love Eva playing the violin for the five minutes on stage. But before we go down there, we're gonna get down and try to get my uh, mower. Oh, right, that too. So welcome back everyone, Mike here. I'm having a little bit of trouble with my bad boy mower. It's been a really good mower, but it's about seven years old. And uh, the other night, let's see, it was two nights ago, I was trying to get down to my mom's place to cut her grass, and I went down past the pond, and uh, almost to my sister's, and it just quit. Shut off, wouldn't do anything. And I kind of figured it was a safety switch, and all I had with me was a Leatherman, so I did something I probably shouldn't have done. You know, you're in a hurry. I just started cutting and disconnecting some uh, safety switches splicing them back together couldn't get it to go and I was starting to get dark because I got into some other things and then last night I went back down and I found a fuse that was blown 25 amp fuse which I did not have surprisingly so I went and bought some 25 amp fuses uh, Melissa's I have a couple I had two tens and a five that's not how it works fuses but anyway we're gonna go down there see if we can't get that mower running I may cut just a little bit of grass but like Melissa said uh, we have to go to an orchestra concert here for Eva this evening. That's Eva playing the violin. Yeah, she plays the violin. All right, before we head down to the pond, I want to show you something we got in the mail yesterday. A couple of picaroons. Two sizes. Brand new. Haven't tried them yet. The handles are hickory. And these came from Hips Tool and Design. That's Hips Tool and Design. Here's their card. I think they're and, up around uh, Clearfield, Pennsylvania. Yeah. And uh, they're all handmade. The uh, hickory comes from their own property, uh, but they look really nice. You can contact Jeff or Brad. Thanks for sending those, and uh, you'll see them put to use in a future video. Yeah, we don't have time this evening to try them out, but uh, we will. They look really well built. Uh, they're really nice. They're, uh, they are. But like I said in other videos, uh, we have two rules when it comes to, uh, you know, getting products from companies because when you have a YouTube channel a lot of people like sending stuff to get it you know out in front of the camera and to show people and it's such a targeted market it works out really well for them it does but the two rules that we have is it has to be something that we would use on our property and uh, we don't like junk and these are right. definitely not junk and we're uh, looking forward to trying them out uh, they're they're used I'm sure you know Melissa but for you don't have to yeah. bend over to pick up firewood right. I'm going to show you the ends of those things Show them uh, what they have on them to protect the points on them. Oh, yeah, yeah. So they got like PVC. And then this just will come off. And... Yeah, because they're sharp. Let me show you one of these. Okay. I mean, that is sharp. Be yep. a nice weapon, too. Would be a nice weapon in a uh, zombie apocalypse or something so like that. Mike's old microphone that broke, the other one broke, too. But anywho, we could put these covers on them. Yeah. We're having problems with... Uh, road microphones big yes. time had two go down in the last two week weeks. or two yeah and uh so if anyone has a suggestion on that let us know please well you want to head down and get the mower sounds good try to okay also got a, a new little camera that i'm trying out right now i think it should be pretty stable i don't know how the audio will be on it but we're just kind of testing it out here on this video why is it stable? Hmm? Why is it stable? Because it's got stabilization. Yeah, so you need to say that, right? Yeah. You better watch the trail. You drive a lot slower when I'm with you. You never know. Might be a deer jump out. I'm going to hang us out the uh, door and see how it does. A bird. Always got to be safe. There's a lot of wildlife. Yeah, you won't be able to see it with this little camera. There's two geese. We're going to see if Lucy's on her nest or if this is another two. They go over right up the bank and just lay their heads up against the leaves to try to like camouflage themselves. Pretty cool. Tell you what, if you go near this nest with them over there, they're coming. It is Lucy. It is Lucy. I wonder if... them up. 
Yeah, we're not going to get too close, but she actually, the eggs are all covered up with feathers. That's the first time she's been off that nest forever. Huh. Yeah, we better not get too close. Yeah, she'll probably be coming up behind me. <laughs> the problem so right there is one of the safety switches I disconnected I'll have to fix that and I'm just gonna replace this uh, 25 amp fuse hopefully that's all it needs I didn't have to uh, look at the book or anything on this I got pretty lucky All right, let's see if this thing will start. Hopefully, it doesn't just keep blowing fuses. We'll see. All right, give it a try. All right, use your rabbit's foot when you need it. Tell you what, I'm gonna uh, mow down here just for a little bit. Okay. You can head back up, but that yeah. way, if it breaks down, you may have to come back and get me. But I think it's all right. Uh, the seat was wet. Oh, uh, your butt's wet. I just got back up to the house. I had a heck of a time uh, getting up the hill there, up the trail. It's still a little bit muddy, as you can see, but the uh, bad boy is back in action. All right, here comes Eva, all ready for the orchestra concert. Are you excited or nervous? Or I'm nervous. Are you? Yeah, you'll do well. Yeah, you'll do really good. They're gonna head down now. I'm uh, gonna get ready, and uh, I'll be down before it starts. It's, okay. Oh, something that I try to mention in every video, yet I forget about 90% of the time. If you enjoy these videos and you're not a subscriber, I would really appreciate it if you go ahead and hit the uh, subscribe button and hit that little bell icon there beside it. But anyway, like we are saying, so I had microphone problems last night, but I actually got a lot done last night. I'm going to show you some of that footage right now.
using the uh, Steel MS661. That's a 91cc chainsaw. I had to sharpen it first. I haven't sharpened it for a while, but that thing rips through that wood. I was uh, cutting up a big hunk of that oak that uh, fell down in the pond there a few weeks back. Got that cut up and I actually split a lot by hand last night. Uh, some of the pieces were really big, but that red oak, you can kind of blow right through it. And when they're real big like that, they're not falling over. So I whacked up a bunch of that with the Fiskers. And then I did run the uh, Big Wolf Ridge some too. Some of those pieces just wasn't going to happen. I wasn't going to waste my time. But I enjoy splitting by hand every once in a while. But there is no way that I could maintain that pace, you know, for four or five hours straight, anything like that. It's just not going to happen. Maybe when I was younger, maybe when I was 20 years old, but back then I probably would have stuck the axe in my leg or something. Uh, but yeah, it was a pretty good evening. I used the RK37, the Fiskers, and the MS661. Got a bunch of wood cut up and split in a hurry. Uh, but we'll have a lot of firewood videos coming up here in the near future. This weekend, I hope to work on the tower blind back there. I got all the posts set. They're all ready to go. Uh, next day or two, if it doesn't rain now, I got to get caught up on some mowing. I got, you know, down at my sister's, I got to do down at the brick house. Our yard needs cut. Uh, just got a lot of that stuff to do. It's that time of year. But anyway, I think that's about it for today's video. Remember, like I said, if you enjoy the videos and you've not yet subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We'd appreciate it. And uh, share these videos with your friends. Thanks. <music>